So somehow I need to fit all of this into this. So we got the back filled up. We got the front with the cooler. And pretty much every last inch. Well, we are about 15 miles away from Cherry Springs right now and it is raining, but it's supposed to stop and clear up tonight, so we'll see. All right, we have made it. Now it's time to see how many people are actually here. This is looking, looking good. Looks like uh, still quite a bit of people here already. That's the check-in tent right there. We're gonna go try to get our normal spot in the back over here and hopefully I can get this tent set up here pretty soon. See all the people, people that came early. All right, as you can see, the sun came out. <laughs> uh, it's hard to see, but um, got my tent up, most of my tent up. Got quite a few people here already. Here we are. We're done. Setting up. These are people that came the day before at the star party. Going to my little screen room. As we go in, bed, queen size mattress, and my table, camera, my food, a little lounge chair here. The skies cleared up just enough Wednesday night for me to get my first ever photo of the Iris Nebula, and I also spent some time doing a little bit of light painting. officially uh, the 2023 Cherry Springs Star Party. People are starting to show up. As you can see right now, it's a beautiful day, so I hope this weather keeps up. All right, so this is the gate to the private sky viewing area. This gate right here will be closed at sunset. So if you get here after sunset, you won't be able to get in. So make sure you're here before sunset and you're not allowed to leave until after the sun rises. So uh, just make sure you're aware of that, All right? Of course, today starts the Cherry Springs Star Party. That happens every June. And then in the fall, in September, they have the Black Forest Star Party. So if you're planning on going during the new moon in June or in September, be aware that there's possibility of a star party going on and you won't be able to get in unless you've signed up for the star party. All right, so once you've entered, you wanna park in these spots here, come over here to the bathroom, grab one of these. So these are all the overnight astronomy observation field uh, information for you. All right, so these are dates that they are going to be closed and this is how you pay for a night or multiple nights fill out all this information put the money into here turn around sometimes people can't find it you slip it into this slot right here there's also a nice map of both fields 
So there are bathrooms here that are open all year long. Um, this is the ones right by the entrance. These are the best ones. Um, they're heated inside. They actually have hand warmers inside too. Um, and a dark red light at night so you can actually see. Not very well, but you can still see. Okay. And this is the star party is going on. Over there you can see our food vendor behind that car there. They'll be here for the entirety of the star party. And people just starting to show up. Now because it's a star party, they do have um, a lot of outhouses here too. So those will be available. Plus there's the other bathroom over in the back corner there. Sometimes I find in the winter that the bathroom all the way in the back corner is open, but the main bathroom is locked. But there's always seems to be a bathroom open here during the entire year. Yeah, this is my friend Tim. Say hi, Tim. Tim just pulled up next to me and set his tent up. And then right here, these people, this is Kurt and Carolyn. So now we're just waiting for other people to show up next to us. It's pretty crowded out here though. And that answered a lot of my questions. But the monkey with the software was... So tonight I splurged on dinner and I ordered from our vendor today and look at this. Philly cheese steak french fries. All right, it is night number two, Cherry Springs, and people are filling in quite nicely. Getting a little packed and uh, we'll see what tonight brings. Um, it's pretty clear, but a little hazy with the smoke. So we'll see what we can get. Nothing like bacon burritos on a rainy Friday morning. It's supposed to be a pretty bad day today. And tomorrow is supposed to be completely the opposite. So everybody's gonna wait and see what happens. This is the beautiful town of Cowdersport. See, it's pretty much surrounded by mountains here. Are getting ready to shoot some stars tonight. Uh, it's a little cloudy now, but it's supposed to clear up. Hey everyone, there's Molly in space right there. See her? All right, so we're getting ready. These are some of the scopes that we're going to use tonight. And here's mine using an Avalux 62 ED with my Pentax K70. That's our adventurer. We've got about 500, 500 people here.
Cherry Springs is such a unique place. This is my fifth trip there, and I have to say I am so happy with the shots I got and with all the people that I met and friends that I've made. And after a night like that, I couldn't resist but to stay one more night.